I didn't know anything about grounding. I had never heard of it at all, but I became a new mom and I had my first child and she had colic and she cried and cried and cried. The first thing I did being a physician myself was take her to the pediatrician and remember distinctly leaving that pediatrician's office with a knot in my stomach because the first thing they told me is it's a baby, let him cry. Literally the only time I noticed that she wasn't in pain and the only time I could soothe her was when I was outside and I was barefoot and I had her in my arms and every time we were outside, she relaxed. I noticed if I did use a stroller or if she was in a car, she was still in pain and uncomfortable. This is not placebo effect. Like she had no idea if I was wearing shoes or not. She doesn't know that. I'm holding her either way. And I just slowly started realizing this child can only take a nap and feel comfort as if she was on my skin, held skin to skin, and I was barefoot. She'd be dead asleep, and if I stepped in the house and took both my feet off the ground, she would wake back up and the pain response would come back. And I didn't know what it was called, and I didn't at that time feel comfortable thinking about using it in my conventional medical practice, but I just knew that this is what I'm gonna do to help my child. I was working with a mentor of mine, and she recommended that I ground my energy. I didn't know what she meant by ground yourself. So the first thing I did was go home and look it up on the internet. And through doing a search uh, about grounding, I found Clint Ober's work and the book about earthing. And I realized that it's a real thing and a real healing modality with tons of medical literature behind it.